Chelsea Janes of the Washington Post. Manny Machado confirms he plans to opt out at the end of the season, said the Padres know where he stands when it comes to a new deal. Noted the market has changed dramatically since he signed. Quote, there's a lot of money out there as a player about to opt out. It's pretty good to see. So he gone at the end of the year, according to the Chelsea Janes tweet. Uh, so the particulars on this, Manny Machado signed a 10-year, $300 million deal with the Padres. If he opts out at the end of the year, which he is contractually able to do, he would be foregoing the final five years and $150 million that are guaranteed. In part, I think, and I'm curious your response to this and for Mark Feinstein's response, I think part of the calculus here for Manny and his agent is they're not only seeing the money in the marketplace in the league, but in the franchise. Tatis gets 340 yeah. for 14 years guaranteed. I mean, he sees the money. They just broke off Darvish. It, he's going to pitch until he's 45, according to this contract. The Padres are spending such crazy money. They've well, created this. He knows this. what Aaron Judge was offered at the Padres. He knows that. Judge, that was Turner, offered. they were in on every – so why wouldn't he? I mean, yeah. he, it's his franchise now, and, and he, is, he is acting according to what the Padres have done – with everybody else on the market. I get it. I get well, what he's doing. I think also, you know, you see Correa got, what, five years, 200? You know, somewhere in that neighborhood. If you're looking at five years, 150, he's already sitting there going, I know I'm going to get more money. But the other thing that he has to look at realistically, too, is he will be highly sought after. Oh, for sure. I mean, for Manny Machado is going to opt out at this point in time of his career, what he is capable of doing. And you know that after Darvis, who's next? It's him on the market. Uh, the free agent class that's coming right now, Manny Machado is going to be the outside of you, Darvis, the most sought after player in that group. Well, so I mean, outside, I say you, uh, you Darvis, Otani. Yeah. Outside of Shohei Otani, Manny Machado will be the most sought after player. Let's bring Mark Feinstein in on this discussion. And Mark, I guess it's interesting now from the team's perspective. Do you roll up your sleeves and give Manny a, a, a brand new huge deal? Or do you earmark some of that money for Soto, who's coming up in two years, or for somebody like Otani, to Harold's point, who's coming up at the end of this year? Well, I think Machado obviously has become a very important person in that clubhouse and to that team, and they know what they're getting there. Soto's been there for a couple of months. Who knows you know, what his year's going to look like? With the Scott Boris factor, would he even sign an extension, or are you going to have to go to free agency with him and uh, you know try to, to outbid the market? Um, you know, I think they can get Machado signed to an extension uh, before the opt out comes if they're willing to, to pay the price. And when you look at some of the deals that are out there, uh, obviously he's going to get more than the the five for one fifty that's left on his deal. When you look at what Devers got and what Judge got, the Judge thing is interesting to me because Manny's going to turn thirty one this July. A few years ago, we would have said, you don't want to be 31 going into free agency. But Aaron Judge just got nine years and $360 million at that age. That is no longer a deterrent. You're seeing guys signed into their late 30s and even early 40s. So, uh, you know, I think when you look at Manny, his AAV right now is $30 million. Even if he signs a new deal that averages 37 38 even 40 it's not like the Padres are going to be adding $40 million to their Payroll, if they sign an extension, you're basically adding on $10 million on top of the 30 that you already had earmarked. So I think there is a way for them to extend him this season, um, but obviously it's going gonna, it's gonna to be costly. My they prediction? had $340 million on the table for the Mets to, for Correa to go play third base. You think Manny's not sitting there going, hey, Buck, Exactly. I, I'm, here I come. I'm ready. Josh Donaldson, a free agent at the end of this year also. The Yankees are potentially going to be in the market for a third baseman. So uh, there are going to be some big bitters out he, there he is gonna be, if he gets to free agency. It's agent, not going to so. matter. He's going to stay right there because the Padres are spending money the way we used to spend money after partying all night in college at, at Taco Bell. I mean, it doesn't matter at that point. You what, you see the menu, and you've had a few beers, and you're like, here, there. A lot of Taco Bell for $300. A lot. A lot. A lot. He's buying franchises. <laughs> that, that's the, the Padres are spending money so crazy. It doesn't matter. He And he all indications are that he likes it there. And he's been a leader on that team. It would not surprise. If I had to rank right now 
likely places that he will be playing on opening day in 2024. I'd have to put the Padres number one. I agree I, with I, you. I got Mets number one. He thinks he's he thinks that he's is. opting out to go elsewhere. I uh, think he's opting out to get a better deal to stay right there, and the Padres are willing to pay him. I mean, I, I think he might want to stay there, but I think the market will shape in such a way that he's going to leave. Uh, here's the other thing I look at too. We're talking about a different Manny Machado than when he was a free agent. Yeah. He doesn't have that stand anymore. He is now revered as a leader. He's a grown-up. He's done all, all, His whole persona has changed from five years ago when Manny was a free agent. It was like, well, he stepped on a guy, and he did this, and he did that. And now it's like, this guy's a leader. He's grown up, and he's one of the guys you want to rely on. Get ready for an Total A.J. Change. Preller signature on a crazy check to keep him right there. I That's I what I say.